Okay, this is going to be a quick video showing you how to make some unclickable um, menu headers, um, which is going to be up here. You'll see my test site here. I don't have anything in the menu right now. I have three sample posts. Um, so we'll go back to Dashboard. And what you're going to do is you'll, in Dashboard, come down to Appearance and then Menus. Okay? We'll do the unclickable. Um, menus first. Okay, so see where it says I have no pages. You're going to go here to links and then all right in this URL box just highlight that and backspace you're going to delete that and then you're going to put this number sign right here the pound sign um, and for link text this is going to be your actual menu heading um, so we're just going to say menu uh, one just to, and then we're going to click add to the menu now when I put this uh, when I save the menu wait for it to save okay then go to my site and I'll refresh Dun -dun 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 -dun. okay Okay, it wasn't showing up. I forgot one step. When you add this menu, um, when you're first starting out with your website um, and you're going to create your menu, you need to go up here to manage locations at the top. And you see here where your top menu has not been assigned. You need to drop down and select that and then save that. Okay, now I can go back. All right, now if I go to my website and I refresh, I should see, dun, da, da, there we go, home and menu one. So menu one is the one I made unclickable. You see when I click on it, nothing happens. Okay, so the next one we're going to do, um, so that's how you make an unclickable menu. Um, now what we'll do is we're going to go to pages. I've already created some pages, so we just have to um, publish them, make it a little easier. And sometime today. Okay, so I have uh, page one, page two, and page three. And then I have some sub pages right here already created. Um, and I have them listed as drafts. So, first thing um, that I need to do is do a quick edit and change it from a draft to published. So I'm going to publish page one, and let's go ahead and publish page three, and let me go ahead and um, pause it real quick while I publish the rest. All right, so all these pages are now published, and we're going to go back to appearance, and then menus again. Now normally you wouldn't um, wait to publish all these out. If I make a page, I normally publish it right away, but for this purpose I just went ahead and, and saved them so I could show you um, everything from the beginning. So I'm going to go ahead and do my sample 1, 2, and 3. You have to select them over anytime you publish a page. Now not a post. When you publish a page, it's going to go to this section. Remember earlier we were here in links to make our unclickable menu. Now what we're doing is we're making our menu headers um, here. You select those pages and then you're going to click click on add to menu. Okay. Now here, once you have it over here, you can drag these. You can see it automatically puts it in alphabetical order. If you just click on it and drag it it's going to put them in, you can put them in whatever order that you want to. So I'll just put them in one, two, three order. Okay. And now that's going to make these um, menu headings now. And they will be clickable. So let me go ahead and save that so I can show you. Okay, now we'll go to our site and refresh. Ok, 
come. There we go. Now remember our menu one was the unclickable menu that we made. I click on it, nothing happens. But if I click on the sample page one, then I'm going to be taken to the new page that we created. And there it is, sample page one. All right, now we're going to go back over here. And then we're going to take these two sub pages that we created, click on those, and then add to menu. And what you can do is you're going to make these um, sub pages. So I'm going to drag, let's do this one, and I'm going to make it a sub page of our unclickable menu. This was our unclickable one. And you can tell the un um, as it'll have a custom button there, whereas these other pages do not. They say page, and that says custom. All right. We'll close already. Okay. <laughs> so um, in order to make a sub page, all you do is you indent it like a paragraph. Um, you just drag and drop it and then so I made that one a sub page of the unclickable menu and then I'm gonna make this one just a sub page of this page three and always anytime you make a change to your menu you want to save it okay and once that's saved I'll take you over to the website and we will refresh Okay, now see, as I sample page three, when I just hover my mouse over it, you can see the second menu, and then the same thing for our unclickable menu. I can't click on it, but um, there's the sub page, and I can click on that, and it takes me to my sub page one. And that's all there is to it. That's how you create your unclickable menu, and then your sub pages. Um, any questions, just let me know. Uh, it takes a few minutes to make these videos um, and a few minutes to upload, upload them to YouTube, but um, I have no problem making them. I don't mind.